Once upon a time, there was a young Zen monk who was very eager to learn and understand the teachings of Zen. He had read countless books, attended numerous lectures, and meditated for hours on end. He was convinced that he had deep understanding of Zen and was well on his way to achieving enlightenment. One day, his master asked him to go to the nearby village to buy some supplies. The monk was excited to get out of the monastery and do something practical. He set out on his journey, feeling confident in his abilities. As he was walking, he saw a beautiful woman standing by the side of the road. She was crying and seemed very distressed. The monk stopped to ask her what was wrong, and she told him that she had lost her way and didn't know how to get back to her village. The monk, feeling compassionate, offered to help her and even carried her across a nearby stream. After he had dropped her off at her village, the monk continued on his journey. As he walked, he couldn't help but think about the woman. He felt guilty for touching her and for breaking his vow of celibacy. He was consumed by guilt and shame and couldn't focus on anything else. When he returned to the monastery, his master asked him about his journey and the supplies he had bought. The monk, unable to keep his guilt a secret, told his master about the woman he had helped and how he had broken his vow of celibacy. The master listened patiently and then asked the monk a question. He said, when you carried the woman across the stream, did you put her down on the other side? The monk replied, yes, of course, I did. The master then said, then why are you still carrying her? The monk realized that he had been carrying the weight of his guilt and shame with him. Even though he had already put the woman down, he had been ignorant of the fact that his guilt was preventing him from living in the present moment and enjoying the beauty of life. The story of the Zen monk teaches us about the power of ignorance. Ignorance is often seen as a negative trait, but it can also be a powerful tool that can help us let go of our negative emotions and live a more fulfilling life. The monk was ignorant of the fact that his guilt was preventing him from living in the present moment. He was carrying the weight of his guilt with him, even though he had already put the woman down. He was not aware of the power of ignorance which could have helped him let go of his negative emotions and move on. Ignorance can help us let go of our negative emotions and live in the present moment. When we are ignorant of our negative emotions, we are not attached to them. We are not holding on to them and we are not identifying with them. We are simply letting them go. The power of ignorance lies in its ability to help us let go of our negative emotions and live in the present moment. When we are ignorant of our negative emotions, we are free to choose how we want to feel and how we want to live our lives. We are not defined by our negative emotions and we are not controlled by them. The story of the Zen monk teaches us an important lesson about the power of ignorance. We can apply this lesson to our lives by learning to let go of our negative emotions and live in the present moment. When we are faced with negative emotions such as guilt, shame or anger, we should try to be ignorant of them. We should not hold on to them or identify with them. Instead, we should let them go and focus on the present moment. We can also apply the lesson of the Zen monk to our relationships with others. When someone wrongs us, we should try to be ignorant of their actions. We should not hold on to our anger or resentment towards them. Instead, we should let go of these negative emotions and forgive them. Forgiveness is a powerful tool that can help us let go of our negative emotions and live a more fulfilling life. When we forgive someone, we are not condoning their actions. By doing so, we can live a more fulfilling life and achieve true happiness. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel, Anything Is Possible Tribe, for more stories and teachings about ancient philosophies and religions. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Stay smile. Namaste.